Hi, my name is Paul, and today is the 30th of January, which is a Thursday, 2020. And welcome to DexMarkets.com. Okay, today we're going to fly through the uh, uh, signal results from the last 24 hours and possibly seven days and 30 days. Okay, starting with the daily results. Let's just come down here. Uh, for the last 24 hours, every signal that is fired by us has come out at 100%, which is pretty damn good for the last day. Uh, looking at the week, <clears throat> coming down, let's have a look for the worst statistic. I like to prefer to go for the worst statistic, that way uh, we know what we're getting into. And the Euro Great British Pound was at 90.5%. Uh, not too shabby at all. Uh, let's quickly pop now. Let's not quickly pop down there. Uh, running at a tiny bit late this morning, I am. Okay, the one hour TNT results. Uh, for the last <coughs> uh, 24 hours or day, uh, looking at this, the worst is the Euro USD at 75%. You see, yep, 75% for the last uh, day, week. Worst percentage was the Euro Great British Pound, 66.7. Uh, and for the month, nothing below 83.1. So everything above 83.1. So fantastic statistics there. Okay, the two hour, for the last 24 hours, signals have fired. Uh, the worst one was the Great British Pound USD, and I'm not really surprised there if anybody's seen the news um, and what's been happening recently for the week. The lowest statistic is 83.3, 83.3, and 83.3, um, three, but again, still 80%. Above 80%, which is damn good in my uh, eyes, um, for the month. Quick look here, 82.9. So, no, 78. And that was the Euro JPY. 78%. Uh, okay. Not particularly good, but everything else is way above the 80%, so I like to call it. And for the TNT, <coughs> excuse my throat, uh, five minute results uh, so far for the last 24 hours. The weakest one uh, was the Great British Pound USD. Seems to be um, a running theme with that at the moment. Now for the week, it was 86.2 and for the month, Again, 94.2. So that was the weakest. Um, Great British Band USD has been the weakest results we've had so far <clears throat> for the month. Right, okay, for those that have stumbled across this recording, um, if you'd like to pop in and onto the YouTube and subscribe to us, where you can get more information, update information about the DexFX markets, our results, and all our upgrades and everything that is happening within the company. I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. Okay, reminding also that we have a free members portal uh, where we let you do a 30 day challenge with us. And on that, we will give you training. Everything here, support tools, tools, everything you need. Um, obviously who we are, what's Nadex, what's Forex, what's the trader's mind. I'm sure we all like to think that we have a trader's mind. We then give you the charts, and because it's a 30 day, we just give you um, three charts and one pair. And here we will explain to you exactly what's going on on our charts. That's a five minute chart. This is the one hour chart. And we will explain 
exactly what our symbols are. These are very basic charts, and this we believe is all you need when trading on the charts at least. Obviously we have to take the news and a couple of other factors, but all that is explained as I've said. And of course on the side, everything at your fingertips, we have the news. And on here, of course, we will teach you and explain to you about the one ball, uh, the two balls and the three balls, what to avoid, what not to avoid. Uh, in fact, everything that you need to know. Going back home, we also have, and it knows so I've got a lot happening at the moment, a lot happening. Anybody that comes here, if you just scroll through and read through what it is that DexFX Markets has for you, I think you will be pleasantly surprised. And of course our uh, famous bot, where everything is at your fingertips. Basically, you set it and then forget it, but that's not a set and forget forever. You really do need to go in and keep an eye on what's happening with news, etc. It has a news avoidance. Oh, just absolutely everything you need. Okay, on that, I must go. Uh, hopefully, we'll speak to you all soon and we'll see you on the inside. Have a great day.